Is with the magnitude of the spill in the Gulf, how can you hold BP accountable? Um, well, <laughs> that answer is ride a bike, which is basically saying uh, we got to get off oil. Uh, but they made they made a lot of money last year. They have a lot of money, BP, and I know the, the magnitude. I mean, a lot of this is, is stuff that's priceless, obviously. But there, there will be the cleanup. There's also going to be the oyster and the, and the shrimp and the fish and all the other, uh, all the other economic impacts that they are going to be, have to be held responsible for. And we'll do everything we can to hold responsibly. Say your friends who say it's going to cost us a fortune because you're mandated to have health care or we'll throw you in prison. First of all, that won't happen. It was interesting. Tom Cover was at a, uh, a town meeting and someone said that. He said, That's not going to happen. Uh, don't listen to Fox. <laughs> this is Tom Cover, one of the most conservative members. So O'Reilly had him on that. He said, and O'Reilly went like, uh, Mr. Coburn, who on Fox said that? Senator Coburn? Coburn said, I, I don't know, I just tried to turn it on Fox. Uh, sir, I've done the research, and no one on Fox has ever said that. Cut to, someone made a montage of all the people on Fox who said it. And it's this long montage of people saying it. And you know what the montage ends with? O'Reilly saying it. So I went to Coburn the next day weekend was over, and I said, hey, you got a little taste of O'Reilly, did you? <laughs> he said, oh, the, both sides are like that. I go, no, they aren't. <laughs> Let me tell you, I can tell, I'm going to inform him about that. But anyway. I saw a recent poll where he has moved ahead of Sue Loudon. I don't know. Yeah. She was ahead by about 20 points a while ago, and some reason she stumbled. Uh, I, you know, I, the chicken thing, the the, the bartering thing. Um, I I've, I've been trying to figure out how that would work. Because I mean, you really have to. You can't just dismiss it out of hand. You have to think about how this would work. So let's say. A guy was going to go, go to the, he, he had to get a, um, heart surgery. he had arrhythmia. Let's say he has a heart arrhythmia and has to get a pacemaker in. So he's, he's, he's got his appointment for a surgery and he goes in and, and they ask at the desk, how are you going to pay for this? He says, well, I'm going to, I'm going to barter. And they say, okay, well then you go to the, go to the barter desk. <laughs>